Episode 4, a pioneer forging a history of safety, ring-shaped reinforcement frame. Here we have some archival footage. Subaru has conducted collision tests since 1965. The results of these tests can be seen within these videos. In 先ほど申しましたスバル In those days, the term collision safety did not even exist. In fact, Subaru's origins lie as an airplane manufacturer. It was the underlying concepts of airplanes, safety and reliability, that spurred on technical development at Subaru. Here we have some collision test data and video of collision tests conducted with the Subaru 360 and its earlier prototype, the P1. The actual tests were miles ahead of others at the time. Subaru has been conducting tests of offset collisions for decades now. Subaru had also focused on the safety of pedestrians from an early stage. それは当時は車が人にぶつかった時にその後歩行者が地面に頭をぶつけて大きな怪我をしてしまうと思われたんですけれども実はその前に車が衝突してまずボンネットとか Subaru subsequently developed a number of features for pedestrian safety. バンパーを飛び出させたり、And today, collision tests are still being conducted now. Various tests are conducted at this facility daily, including car-to-car -car collision tests. This is the collision simulator. This simulator actually recreates collisions, allowing researchers to assess the level of damage sustained by both the interior of the car and passengers alike. A variety of tests can be repeated over and over without even using an actual test car.
、まあ、一般的にもそう言われてますけども車っていうのは基本的にはレールの上を走る電車とは違いますからいろんな方向からこう障害物が飛んでくるもしくは自分が飛んでいって危害を与えるという形になりますので、まあ、そういう時に車の全方位をとにかく安全にしてあげなきゃいけない。スバルに関わるその外側の人たちに対する安全性にも配慮するというそういう意味を込めて全方位安全という名称を使わせていただいています。The ring-shaped reinforcement frame was developed to provide safety in every direction. Why does he have a bird cage? The ring shaped reinforcement frame is designed to envelope and protect passengers from collisions, much in the same way as a cage protects the birds inside. This Subaru proprietary technology prevents the cabin of the car from deforming regardless of which direction a collision occurred, resulting in an extremely safe body. The frame protects the cabin by distributing collision energy throughout the entire body. This technology has earned the legacy and Forrester leading collision safety assessments by authorities around the world. Subaru has been rated particularly highly in pedestrian safety tests. One factor behind such high ratings is the low position of the boxer engine. Its low overall height enables the space at the front of the bonnet to absorb collision energy. During a frontal collision, the engine submarines, that is, it is pushed down under the car to stop it from entering the cabin. Subaru continues to be rated highly in safety assessments, yet researchers are not simply in it for the ratings. Subaru collects and analyzes data obtained from accidents around the world. Actual accidents are recreated from a variety of angles before tests are conducted. How will collision safety evolve? To develop even more environmentally friendly cars, they will have to be designed so that they are even lighter than today. それを重くしない重くしちゃうと燃費は悪くなるということなので軽くいかに強くするかっていうのは燃費と衝突の両立というのは非常に大きな課題ではあるんですよ軽くいかに強くっていうところがキーワードだと思いますね材料の面から構造の面からあの非常に幅広い研究をもとにして軽くいかに強くするかっていうのがあの技術力だと思います it is absolutely clear that Subaru is maximizing the technology born from its roots as a manufacturer of airplanes. Thank you.